Hello, fellow enthusiasts of intriguing mysteries and celebrity news. Today, we delve into the enigma surrounding the talented actor Darius McCrary. In the realm of Hollywood, where fame and fortune often collide with the unpredictable twists of life, Darius McCrary's recent experiences have left fans and media outlets alike buzzing with speculation. Join me as we embark on a journey to unravel the mystery of what happened to Darius McCrary, a puzzle that promises to reveal the complexities of fame, resilience, and the ever-watchful eyes of the public. Darius McCrary, known for his roles in Family Matters and The Young and the Restless, is an American actor and singer with a net worth of $10,000. Rising to fame as Eddie Winslow in the long-running sitcom Family Matters, which aired from 1989 to 1998, McCrary gained widespread recognition. The show spanned nine seasons, comprising 215 episodes. Additionally, he made appearances on the soap opera, The Young and the Restless, in the role of Malcolm Winters. Financial Problems Over the years, he has faced significant financial challenges, bringing his personal struggles to the public eye. In November 2017, McCrary found himself in a courtroom, revealing a dire financial situation. At that time, he disclosed that he owed a substantial $90,000 to the Internal Revenue Service IRS. The gravity of his financial crisis had reached a point where he had to move in with family members due to near insolvency. Seeking relief, he requested a reduction in child support payments. Citing a meager income from his most recent acting gig, which reportedly paid him only $125 per day for a seven-day shoot. Further financial hardship surfaced in a 2019 court filing when McCrary claimed to have earned a mere $500 in the preceding year. These revelations shed light on the precarious nature of his financial standing, raising questions about his ability to sustain himself and meet his financial obligations. Fast forward to December 2023, and Darius McCrary faced another setback as he was arrested for failing to pay child support. At the time of his arrest, his outstanding child support debt amounted to a significant $53,000. Notably, McCrary is obligated to pay his ex-wife, Tammy Bronner, a monthly sum of $1,300 for the support of their child. The actor's story underscores the importance of financial responsibility and planning, even for those in the entertainment industry. As we observe his journey, it becomes clear that navigating the complexities of fame and finances requires careful consideration and prudent decision-making to avoid the pitfalls that can lead to such challenging circumstances. Darius McCrary, born on May 1, 1976, hails from Walnut, California. While details about his mother are scarce, his father, Howard McCrary, is recognized as a composer, singer, and music director. Growing up, Darius received early encouragement from his father to explore the realm of entertainment. Additionally, he has a younger brother named Donovan. The influence of his musical family likely played a role in shaping McCrary's early connection to the world of entertainment. Darius McCrary's journey in the entertainment industry began at a remarkably young age, showcasing his talent and versatility. At the tender age of 11, McCrary made his cinematic debut in the 1987 film, Big Shots. This early exposure paved the way for his involvement in television, with appearances on popular shows like Amen and Hooperman. Notably, he also contributed to the 1988 film Mississippi Burning, showcasing the breadth of his budding acting skills. In 1989, a significant turning point arrived as McCrary secured the pivotal role of Eddie Winslow in the television show Family Matters. The show not only ran successfully for an impressive nine seasons until 1998 but also claimed the title of the second longest-running live-action sitcom featuring a predominantly African-American cast at that time. Garnering acclaim from both audiences and critics, Family Matters earned numerous awards and nominations, a testament to McCrary's contribution to the show's success. Throughout its run, he received three Young Artist Award nominations, further solidifying his place in the industry. Following the conclusion of Family Matters in 1998, McCrary continued to make waves in the entertainment world. His roles diversified, with him landing the lead role in Something to Sing About, a Christian drama produced by the Billy Graham Evangelistic Association. His journey continued with main cast roles in shows like Freedom in 2000 and Kingpin in 2003, showcasing his ability to adapt to different genres and formats. McCrary's foray into film during this period included notable appearances in Kingdom Come and 15 Minutes, adding cinematic milestones to his repertoire. 
His ability to transition seamlessly between television and film demonstrated his versatility as an actor. In the mid-2000s, McCrary continued to make waves on the small screen. Notably, he secured a significant role in the main cast of the show, Committed, in 2005, highlighting his ongoing commitment to diverse roles. A heartening reunion with his Family Matters co-star, Kelly Shanina Williams, occurred on UPN's show, Eve, in 2006, where they shared the screen for two episodes, fostering a sense of nostalgia for fans of the iconic duo. McCrary's vocal talents found expression in the 2007 blockbuster, Transformers, where he lent his voice to the character Jazz. This marked a notable venture into voice acting, a skill he revisited in 2009 with the character Tarix in the film, Bionicle, The Legend Reborn. Concurrently, he made his presence felt in mainstream cinema with roles in films such as Next Day Air and Saw IV, showcasing his ability to seamlessly transition between genres. Beyond the screen, McCrary graced the stage in various theater productions, including The Compelling, The Maintenance Man, highlighting his commitment to diverse artistic expressions. In 2009, his journey led him to the soap opera world as he joined the cast of The Young and the Restless for two seasons, portraying the character Malcolm Winters. By 2011, McCrary, fueled by a growing interest in music, was ready to release his first album, showcasing a multifaceted artistic identity. In the subsequent years, McCrary's television career remained vibrant. He played recurring roles in Anger Management, 2012, The Leftovers, 2015, and Star, 2016, affirming his enduring appeal to audiences across different shows and genres. Fast forward to 2018, and McCrary found a new home on the show, Monogamy, further expanding his television portfolio. The year 2020 saw his presence in the film, True to the Game 2, a role he reprised in the following year with True to the Game 3, showcasing his ongoing commitment to the craft, personal life, love is a complex journey, and for actor Darius McCrary, it has been nothing short of a roller coaster. In 2005, McCrary took a leap into marital bliss by tying the knot with Juliet Ban. However, the honeymoon phase was short-lived as the couple parted ways in 2006, marking the end of their brief union. Love, it seemed, was elusive for McCrary in those early years. Undeterred, McCrary gave love another chance in 2009, exchanging vows with his longtime friend. Kareen Steffens, an accomplished author, the hope for a lasting companionship, however, was dashed as the couple decided to part ways in 2011. The challenges of sustaining a marriage were becoming evident, but McCrary remained resilient. In 2014, McCrary embarked on a new chapter of love as he walked down the aisle with Tammy Bronner. Their union bore fruit in the form of a beautiful daughter named Zoe. Together, they navigated the joys and responsibilities of parenthood, creating a family bond that seemed unbreakable. Despite their efforts, the journey of love took an unexpected turn, and in 2017, McCrary and Bronner decided to go their separate ways, bringing another chapter of his romantic saga to a close. Dear my audience, although Darius McCrary is not a rich actor, his heart is always warm, as he has pledged to support and accompany a number of charity funds for many years. Philanthropy Darius McCrary, the accomplished actor known for his roles on and off the screen, is also making waves in the realm of philanthropy. As the founder of the Father's Care Organization, a nonprofit with a heartfelt mission, McCrary is taking steps to empower fathers and strengthen the bonds they share with their children. The Father's Care Organization, operating under the umbrella of the McCrary Foundation, is a beacon of support for fathers seeking education and assistance in navigating the challenges of parenthood. The Foundation is not just a personal endeavor for McCrary, it's a family legacy. The McCrary Foundation was initiated by his aunts and uncles who themselves formed the gospel and R&B group, The McCrary's, a musical journey that mirrors their commitment to making a positive impact. The Father's Care Initiative is a response to the needs of fathers who strive to be actively involved in their children's lives. McCrary, drawing inspiration from his own experiences and recognizing the importance of fatherhood, established this nonprofit to provide a helping hand to fathers on their journey of nurturing and supporting their families. The organization's focus goes beyond mere assistance, it emphasizes the power of education in equipping fathers with the tools they need to foster healthy relationships with their children. Through workshops, counseling, and community outreach, 
Fathers Care aims to create an environment where fathers can thrive in their roles and contribute positively to their children's upbringing. Thank you for watching the entire video. Leave us your comments in the section below. We hope you have found this helpful video. Don't forget to leave a like, share, and subscribe to the channel if you like it. Thank you for watching this, and see you in the next videos. Goodbye.